Greetings, YouTube world. You just caught me doing my Astros losing dance. Ha ha! This is Diet Dr. Griffin. And you know what season it is when Marty Cordova, the greatest rookie of the year in the history of baseball, who also happened to miss time because he got sunburned on tanning bed. I'm picking the World Series! Hooah! In the National League, we have the losers, known as the Los Angeles Dodgers, who only have one good thing going for them, and that's Joe Kelly and that lovely little meme of his. Versus the Tampa Bay, I used to be the devil, Rays. Fun fact, my dad lives in the Tampa area, and he went to a Rays game a number of years ago. Maybe like four or five. And it was when Big Poppy was doing one of his last hurrahs down there. And they ran out of food by like the fifth inning of the game. I mean, come on, you run out of food at a ballpark. And there's only like 10 people there anyway, because Tropicana Field is like the worst baseball stadium known to man. And you're also talking about a sport where they still play games at the Oakland Coliseum. You know, where the sewage leaks out every five minutes and there's rats in the RC Cola machine. In my amazing video that I not only forgot to upload, but I forgot to actually make, I had predicted that the World Series would be between the Yankees and the Marlins. I wanted to have Jeter have to face his old team. I thought that would be a really dramatic and interesting story. And those lovable little Marlins never lost of a series until they lost to the Braves this year. Swing, bada 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 swing. Those dodges can really, really hit. And Corey Bellinger better hope that his dislocated shoulder doesn't impact his uh, performance in this series. I mean, come on. This COVID stuff is getting a little crazy here. You can't even high-five each other. You have to dislocate shoulders as a sign of showing appreciation for one's uh, home run hitting capabilities. Come on, guys. Just, just high-five. That, that's probably the safer thing for everybody involved. Then you can just put some hand sanitizer on and you'll go on with your day. You might have to play fantasy baseball to actually be able to name more than two people on the Rays team. But they just have a lot of starting pitching. Guys like Blake Snell and Tyler Glass now and Charlie. I used to be a Astros cheater Morton. Those guys are elite. And we all know Clayton Kershaw is going to blow up at some point in, the, in this round. He did last round. He always blows up when it counts the most. Now, on to my pick. I'm going to take the Tampa Bay I used to be the Devil Rays in six games. Yeah, I'm going the underdog here. The Dodgers might be the better team on paper, and they certainly have the better lineup, but there's something about this Tampa team that I just can't give up on. They have a sum of the parts mentality like many of the old New England Patriots teams did before Tom Brady really started cheating as opposed to just Belichick cheating. And there you have it, my World Series picks. Now next year, my little Red Sox guys, they're going to cr start crawling out of the cellar and maybe make it to third place. Maybe. Ta-ta.